as always, every trip begins with uh, Burger King. It's not particularly healthy, but it is a tradition. Got a water for Maxi. And a chicken royale tomato. Enjoy. Thank you. Are you ready? Yep. So let's go catch a plane. Two waters for 18, one for 10. It's a good deal at an airport. And then there's of course some shopping. Just for waters. Somewhere down here. To. I got that wrong. So we're going to gate B9, which is straight ahead. You see down the sign? B2 to B19. So let's make sure this is our gate area. Gate, Oslo, B9, even 1700, 5 o'clock. SK1468 to Oslo, gate B9. Straight down that passage, just ahead. And with a bit of luck, Maro put some speed on, so we can film this. And we're going down passageway B, which is not a route we often use. Which those of you who are used to watching our videos, you'll see this is quite a new passageway, at least for us. White tiles. This is one of Sass's main departure areas. Now we're heading for gate B9, so it's somewhere around this area. It's rather busy here. B10, there's B9. We are B9. Mara looks like she's double checking. I see it. This gate 1468, as far as I can see. Our gate. Gate B9. This is doing Facebook updates. Be on the plane. Ready? So it's Tomac embarkation today. Here goes Maro. Nice view. What a treat. Doesn't happen very often in Copenhagen this. LNRP something registration. Well, that was rather nice. It's the uh, second time we've done it here. Hi, good day, good day. Thanks. Hi. Business as always. Business as always for some of us. That was a nice embarkation. Yeah. 
So the Boeing 737? It looks like pretty full, yeah. It's not the best takeoff window I have here. Make the best of it. I can't get the whole wing properly, but I'll see if I can keep the angle for takeoff. While well, we're here already on the ground, let's have a look at the tray. There's a leg room. I don't know what really what I can call this. I can still move my legs, but it's not very much space at all over here. Now those legs are just leg room enough. As always. As always. Let's try and demonstrate the tray here. Um, not that we need the tray here, if we're lucky we get a coffee. The rest you can buy. Oh, that's a sliding table, as usual. And apparently there's Wi-Fi on board too. It's not free, is it? Pay go, pay a few for the service. Okay, so what do we have in the seat pocket? A plastic seat pocket. It's not the normal one down there. Well, there is. But there's nothing in it. Oh, safety card. Boeing 737-800. It's rather hot in here. Or is it just me? Is it hot in here? <laughs> oh, it's always me. Now we have the safety card. Comes. Looks like some kids set, magic sticker set. Mario can play with that at home. Ooh. Someone already did the stickers. It's nice anyway. There is something for you too, you can find the difference. So it's a little bit of kids' entertainment. The Scandinavian Traveler. Is this an in-flight magazine? I believe it is. Skim through it as usual. It's fleet information, destination routes, articles, articles about routes. That was this month, September's Scandinavian Traveller magazine. And lastly, we'll end off with the in-flight menu. Nowadays nothing's free on short routes. This flight included, when we're talking about economy class. Prices look like money. What do you think what you can see? Expensive, cheap. Where is beer? Then I can tell you. I can't see because I'm zooming. I see a beer deal up there. 55 Danish Kroner. Yeah, potato chips or salted cashews. Not bad. 55, jeez, that's pretty expensive. Is that about 7 euros? And that completes this tour. Oh, the amount of found a bath bag. She found two of them. Let's see what the quality is. A little bit folded here on the bottom, but it can't be helped. Tear off to open, Mara. Tear it when you need it. Once again, it doesn't have that nifty little folding wire to close the bag if one really did have to use it. Well, above that with the SAS logo on it. Let's close that tray. Slam in. Open it again. Just a little click. And there is a net there. I just noticed that it says you can drink with both hands. I just noticed you can drink with both hands. There's two glass holders. I don't think that's what it means. And now the English version. Good afternoon and welcome on board again. We are ready for us for Gardevoir. Flight time is close to an hour in nice conditions all the way. We are now preparing for departure. Select flight mode on the mobile phone and on the electronic devices if you want to use it during your flight. 
Your laptop must be used up to place a cab baggage or take off a landing. We ask you to place the cab baggage and then to take the front view of the overhead compartment. Uh, just getting on board the last uh, cargo luggage. Well, I'm just getting comfortable here. Yeah. Of course. Couldn't be better now, could it? Uh, Mado's premium and champagne. I've already said forget it. Just still trying. We got that bottle of water. Down there. Right now, look guide you to your exit. Look for an area exit as it may be located behind you. You're welcome to use electronic devices on this flight, but it's activated during the entire. So we're supposed to fly at 5 o'clock, and it seems we have a little delay. This is my trusty pulsar over here. About nine minutes past five. We were waiting for some luggage to be put on board. I suppose we lost our slot. We were just waiting for aircrafts behind us, folks. So
So the water is free. So is we, got, we got one each. It's bubbly water. It's bubbly water.
grams now. Norwegian, even the Lufthansa over here. If you have a domestic flight connecting with the SS or Vidra huh? and are travelling without really? check baggage, we would like you to, uh, like to remind docking. you that you can proceed directly to the departure wall and follow the connecting doorway symbols. Bing! And we are in Oslo. <laughs> okay, thank you. Bye bye. Have a nice week. <clears throat> Connecting flights. Yeah. It's very warm here. Okay. And here we have our first glimpse of Oslo's Gardermoen. Yeah. 